Hi, I am Sarathi and in this video we are going to discuss about how to set search options for a data discovery entity that is already done, that is already created. So in order to set search options for a data discovery entity, we would log in to the ILM admin console first. And once it logs in under data discovery, we see an option called search options. So under search options, we would see the application version, application and the entity. This entity is already created in the EDM for data discovery. So all that we are going to do now is to set the search options, which means what column should be displayed in the technical view and what should be the display name for these columns in the technical view. So first I would select the product family version then I would select the application then I will select the entity for which I want to set then I would say edit and by default it would first display the driving table of that entity in the search options so if I want to display only certain columns I will select only those those columns or if I want to select all columns for display I could select it for display so and I can select what are the columns based on which I would want to search in the search file archive so I would select only ID column because I do not want to search on the name column and I do not want the part column to be displayed in the technical view here I can give a name and this is how this column name would be displayed in the technical view so I would save it and the search options are saved say I would want to change the way the child table columns look then I would again edit the entity and I can add an entity table here so I would add the entity table it displays all the tables available in this entity so suppose I want to set search options for the child table I would select it and I would repeat the same say the ID of the parent table is joined with the ID of child table so I may not want to display the ID again in child table so I will select only child ID for display and the department and I can give any name based on which it could show that this column belongs to the child table so I would give a separate description and this is how this column would be displayed in the technical view with the name child underscore child ID but not with the name child ID so I would save this if it is saved then the entity search options are saved successfully so this is how we set the search options for a data discovery entity in the ILM admin console so in this video we have learned how to log into the ILM web console and how to set search options for a data discovery entity that is already created in the EDM thank you we would love to hear from you and you could follow us on Twitter or for any questions and feedback you could always write to us on support videos at informatica.com thank you